If you've seen the 2005 version of Pride and Prejudice, then you most likely recognize this as Pemberley, Mr. Darcy's stately home. You may also recognize it from countless other period films and television series, as it is quite a popular filming location. However in real life, this historic 35,000-acre estate is known as Chatsworth House. Nestled in the heart of the picturesque Derbyshire Peak District in England, Chatsworth House boasts a rich and storied history that spans centuries. Often referred to as the Palace of the Peak, it stands as one of England's most iconic stately homes. The story of Chatsworth begins in 1549, when Sir William Cavendish, treasurer of the King's Chamber and the husband of Bess of Hardwick, purchased the property for a mere £600. They began with the construction of an original grand mansion. However, this original mansion has long been reconstructed. The house as we know it today, took shape starting in the 17th century when their descendant, the 4th Earl of Devonshire, later elevated to the 1st Duke of Devonshire, embarked on a grand renovation project. Note that subsequent generations have also played a hand in shaping this magnificent estate with numerous alterations. Architects like William Talman and Thomas Archer played pivotal roles in transforming Chatsworth into a Baroque masterpiece. The renowned landscape architect, Lancelot Capability Brown, was also commissioned to create the stunning gardens and shape the surrounding parkland. The result was an opulent estate that seamlessly blended architectural brilliance with natural beauty. Chatsworth House has been the ancestral seat of the Cavendish family the Dukes of Devonshire, since its inception, and remains home to the current 12th Duke, Peregrine Cavendish, and Duchess Amanda Haywood Lawnsdale. They are involved in the home's operation through a charitable trust. The family's patronage of the arts and sciences has left an indelible mark on the house, with its rooms adorned with an impressive collection of art, furniture, and artifacts. Visitors can wander through the painted hall, the state apartments, and the sculpture gallery, marveling at masterpieces by the likes of Rembrandt, Gainsborough, and Reynolds. Over the centuries, Chatsworth has welcomed numerous notable guests, including royalty, politicians, and intellectuals. The estate has witnessed historical events and societal changes, standing as a silent witness to the passage of time. The Chatsworth estate has also played a vital role in agricultural innovation, with the introduction of new farming techniques, and the establishment of model farms. Fast forward to the 21st century, and Chatsworth has evolved into a cultural hub. Its magnificent architecture, well-manicured gardens, breathtaking landscapes, and storied halls make it a popular destination for tourists and history enthusiasts alike. Visitors can lose themselves in a maze, marvel at the gravity-defying cascade, spend a night in one of its country cottages, dine at the numerous restaurants, acquire their own bust of Mr. Darcy, or simply soak up the beauty of the surroundings. The house also hosts various events throughout the year, including art workshops, garden shows, and craft fairs, ensuring that its legacy remains alive and well in the 21st century. So whether you're a history buff, an art enthusiast, or just someone looking for a delightful stroll through time, you are invited to take part in the splendor of this enduring symbol of English heritage.